Welcome back guys. Today I wanted to talk about five simple habits that really changed my life as a colorist or as a human being in, in general. And uh, yeah, so I still think it's very important that I keep talking about this stuff because there's much more to it than just grading all the time. And uh, there's much, there are many more keys to success um, as, a, as a colorist or a freelance artist in that case. Um, so the first habit that I uh, developed is that I always do a workout in the morning or I go walking with the dog. We have a dog. You can also walk without a dog, of course. Um, but uh, the dog is something very, uh, very good to force yourself to go outside and to get some fresh air and to uh, get some sunlight not during winter time because I'm always getting up at 6, 6.30 in the morning, but it, it really helps me to get a clear head in the morning and it helps me to start my day in a, in a positive way. And uh, so I really like to do that. The second habit that I also do mostly right away in the morning is that after waking up, I like to drink water. And uh, so that habit that I that I have is to drink enough water most of the time, at least. Um, there's still some days where it's not not enough, but especially if you're doing sports or you're doing a workout or walking in the morning, you should always uh, drink enough. So for in my case, I'm uh, six feet tall and I weigh around 90, 95 kilograms. <laughs> <laughs> that's a, a huge range it, it will be a bit more during uh, Christmas time this year <laughs> probably um, so I always like to drink water in the morning um, gives you much more energy during the day water in general will help you be or have more performance for your grading for your work whatever you do whatever work you do and um, I always uh, uh, so drink enough water during the day um, in my case, it's, like I said, it's four liters. Uh, just um, if, if you're between three and four liters every day, you should be fine. Then advice or habit number three is always do your lunch break. It doesn't matter at what time. It should be around 12, 12 p.m., 1 p.m., something like that. Always do your lunch break. I had some rough days in the beginning of my career where I just thought, man, I don't have time. Uh, even if you do 30 minutes, you just get some rest for your eyes. Um, you, you come back with fresh eyes, fresh, fresh, fresh eyes into your project, and um, you have m more energy. And uh, just always do your lunch break because uh, you know if you don't do it and it's, it, it gets a bit more late for the job and you don't have the energy, then it will suck. I can tell you that. And habit number four is eat good food. Don't always order food and uh, try to cook your own stuff. Eat some vegetables and just uh, if, if you know that you will be tired after eating too many carbs then don't do it. <laughs> um, it every person's different there, but um, it's, it's the same with the water. It will keep you energetic it will give you much more power for the day it will uh, just just make your life so much easier it's like there's some very simple basic stuff which just which is just like a cheat code and something like that you know um so it, it very simple habits that i tell you here but they're so important just do it just do it try to do it it, it won't always be possible when, but when you have it in control just uh, try to always do it and the last advice or habit that i wanted to give you is um go to bed early get enough sleep and always go to bed at the same time i had some some rough years uh, in the last few years actually where i always got up at a different time i was always groggy i was always tired and once i changed that in combination with all the other stuff that i just told you um like i said i'm getting up early most of the days <laughs> i'm a night owl actually and it's it was very hard for me to get up at 6 6 30 in the morning <laughs> And uh, especially if you don't always have to, because some days you don't have a job and uh, you still, you should still get up and do some, you know, get more knowledge on grading or whatever you're doing. 
and when you wake up at the same time and you get your seven and a half or seven between seven and nine hours some all the people are different um, then you should be fine and it's again in, in combination with all the other stuff it will be like a cheat code yeah so um i know this was a bit more general i'm not a fitness youtuber or, or anything like that but i think it's still all that stuff gives you so much value in terms of um, your work day and your life in general so so uh, i think it's very important to to give this advice um, and, and many people will know that already but if you're like me and you like to watch self-improvement videos then you will probably watch this one as well <laughs> so um like i said i hope you guys enjoyed this and i hope to see you in the next one